The AP Giannini Foundation supports postdoctoral research fellows who are conducting basic research. Their basic research lays the foundation for discovery and innovation that helps all of us. We didn't get to the moon just because of engineering. We had to have a lot of pure science. A lot of what we do may seem far removed from what people are considering in their daily lives because many of us will focus on molecules and cells. It's all really part of a bigger question of how processes in biology happen and, and when that goes wrong, how disease arises. Discovery is very serendipitous and that uh, discoveries that are made in one area uh, by a very curious individual that may have maybe even very little interest in terms of its translatability or impact on society. But the individual is just uh, so curious about scientific questions that those results many times are the ones that have some of the highest impact. IT, um, the basic findings were originally from mathematics. So it just takes a little bit of lacking period of time for us to fully appreciate its impact. I come at research from really a disease angle. That's always been the lens through which I see basic research. And I think that there's obviously tremendous interest in the public in better understanding how disease happens and ways that we can address it. Basic science is crit critically important because it provides a guideline and incentive for both academics to understand the basic mechanism of the disease and just in general basic biology but also provide a framework for industry to pursue that. And so I think that for that reason there really should be a tremendous interest in the greater public in basic science. We are at a new level of understanding about what are the basic tools and components that assemble life forms. And it's the advent of the genomics era that's unlocking this. In the end, it's basic science that's going to underpin the, the research that will allow us to better understand the causes of disease and then allow us to be able to develop effective therapeutics against them. So I think it's as exciting as the discovery of the microscope that unleashed new worlds that weren't seen to scientists previously. We are at the dawn of this. It's a very exciting time to be a biologist.